You know, every now and then something comes along that completely revolutionizes vlogging. Some things that come to mind are the Canon G7X, the RX100 series of cameras, and today, that's gonna be a complete all-in-one solution to selfie stick. Ignore the car behind me. All right, vlog number two. It's gonna be a little bit different today. I know that I just started this thing, but I really, really wanna review something because I've been doing YouTube for the past six years and I'm really, really excited about something that I got and I have to share it with basically whoever is interested in doing YouTube or whoever is interested in doing video in general. I'm really, really stoked about this thing that I got. So without further delay, say hello to the Yuntang Bluetooth selfie stick. Now what's really interesting about this selfie stick right off the bat is how small it is. Now it's hard to get a sense of just how small this is. Well, I guess I could just put it up to my head, but I have a fairly large head, so. It's hard to get a scale for just how small this is just by showing you on camera. So let me, let me show you. This is a water bottle. This is the Yuntang selfie stick. Now, why am I so psyched about this thing? First of all, this is what I've been get using to get the job done as far as vlogging goes. It's a really large, bulky selfie stick with a mini Manfrotto tripod at the bottom. The quality of this is unmatched. But look at how big this is. Y you can't deny that holding this everywhere you go to vlog, I mean like, it gets a good angle for you, but holding it you know, going to the stores, going on vacation, it's too big. This Yuntang selfie stick, check this out. This Yuntang selfie stick is able to go into itself, be small, pull it straight out, and you have an incredibly long selfie stick. This is like 20 inch selfie stick. In fact, I'm pretty sure it might actually be longer. Look at how long this is. I could get a shot of everyone in my family with this thing. And it just comes back in, all the way back, into this super tight little compact selfie stick. This thing literally fits in my pocket. Granted, I'm wearing gym shorts, so I have fairly large pockets. But as someone who's been vlogging for six years, let me tell you, I have been thrown out of more stores than I can count because my equipment is too large and they think that I'm filming a movie. I can try to explain to them that I'm not filming anything worthwhile except maybe a YouTube video that'll do a thousand views back in, you know, when I used to vlog. But this, this is small. This is tiny, this is micro. Again, I can extend it or make it as small as I want, but look at how small it is. Like, th there's no comparison. Not only that, but what this has that this doesn't have is a ball head at the top. So I'm actually able to adjust the angle at which my camera is, whereas this one can only go up or down. So like, if I unlock this little part, then this goes up and down, but that's it. I can't control which direction the camera's facing. This one gives me full freedom to do that. And if I wanted to, it actually comes with a cell phone adapter, so you can literally connect it and take pictures with this shutter button. You know what, at first I didn't think I was gonna show off the ability to use your cell phone with this selfie stick, but I, I couldn't resist. It's just too convenient. It's so big and I want this to be comprehensive. So here it is. Here is my phone on the selfie stick. All right, so it has this neat little controller. It's right here in the middle of the selfie stick. You just pull it out. There's my camera. And it takes your picture, right there. The first thing about that that's cool is that I can have my camera all the way over here and still take the picture just fine. But also, if I wanted to get a nice family shot and have it all the way extended, like, you know, actually holding it like a selfie stick, I could. But now that it's on a tripod, I could literally have everyone in the whole shot, like, in my entire family, and just take the picture just like that. All right, now a couple of quick disclaimers. The first one is I'm not paid in any way to review the selfie stick. I'm not being paid for by the company. I'm not being, I don't have an affiliate link, nothing. I, I'm, I just really am excited about this selfie stick. Now I don't own the company obviously, 
But this thing is really just changing the world of logging. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. It's plastic. It is plastic through and through, all the way in. I would love for there to be a metal version of this. I would gladly pay up to 10 times more for it if it was you know, more durable, but I feel like it's enough for a cell phone or a small camera. I feel comfortable putting my Canon G7X, the thing that I'm recording with right now, on this. I'm not gonna lie to you, it gets a, uh, it gets a little thin on these, on these last parts. So if I were to use my Canon G7X, I'd probably max out at about here, you know, where it's still thick. But still, that's a lot of room to be able to vlog. That's a lot of space. And just knowing that I'll also be able to turn this into a little tripod whenever I want, like all the way up to here, that's, that's invaluable. You need to be able to have a vlogging setup that allows you to put the camera down and have a nice little framed shot. But the fact that it's also able to fit in my pocket, that's insane. That's why I truly think that this is a revolutionary product and why everyone that does daily vlogging should be using this. Anyway, that's why I'm really excited about this Yuntang Bluetooth selfie stick. I think it's an amazing product. Back to our normal vlogging starting tomorrow. I, I just didn't have time to film a vlog today, but I did get this product in the mail and I'm just super, super excited to start using it and seeing what it's capable of. Thank you for watching and if you enjoyed the video, be sure to subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you can see all of our new videos. I'm sure I'm going to do more tech reviews in the future or product reviews in the future. But for now, we're going to get back to our daily vlog. I didn't have Jacqueline in this episode at all. Hi Jacqueline, how are you? Uh, I'm bad.